Staying on top of that breaking news tonight out of Roswell. Good evening and thanks for being with us tonight. I'm Jennifer Bellamy and I'm Faith Jesse. So the GBI is now investigating this shooting involving Roswell police. They say that this shooting uh, before, before shooting the suspect rather he tried to stab a bus driver. So our Cody Alcorn joining us live tonight following this story. Cody, what have we learned in the last hour? Well, Faith and Jennifer, not much has changed out here off Alpharetta Highway. We are still waiting on the GBI crime scene unit to show up to start processing this scene behind me. Let me step out of the way. Now, it is a large crime scene. If you're familiar with this area, it's right in front of Jackson Acura car dealership. Happened on the sidewalk in front of this dealership. You can see the Roswell K9 unit there and then an SUV behind that with the door open. We believe those two officers were definitely involved. There's also a motorcycle cop with its lights still on behind that Explorer who probably also was involved. What's happening right now, the GBI is talking with those officers who engaged with this armed suspect here on a very busy highway. As you guys mentioned, all we know right now is Marta says this suspect got on a bus, at some point got into an argument about paying a fare, which probably was only a couple of dollars. The bus driver kicked the, dry, the rider off. That is when apparently the suspect tried to stab this bus driver. That's when Roswell police were called onto the scene trying to track that suspect down. The stop just right a few hundred feet from me. They engaged with this suspect here. We're told that suspect charged at them with this what we believe is a knife. That's when officers opened fire. Witnesses say they heard up to six gunshots. That suspect has now been taken to a local trauma center. No update on that man's condition, but we can tell you right now two lanes of Alfred Highway are open, but two lanes are closed. It's a very busy highway, so a lot of delays here and around Roswell. We're working to get more information from the GBI, and we'll bring that to you coming up at the top of the six o'clock hour. All right, Cody, thank you so much for continuing to update us on this situation and we will stay on top of this investigation bringing you more information as it comes in you can get updates when you're on the go by downloading the 11 alive news app free in your app store also